Hi world, Ashley here. Today I am bringing you my bee room cliff tag video. I'm pretty excited about this. I'm also very nervous, so I guess we'll see what happens. I was tagged by Nerds Like Us 97, and I believe that this tag was originally done by Poem Bananas Books, so I will link both of those lovely people below if you'd like to check them out. And yeah, I guess let's get started. So basically, for anyone who doesn't know what this tag is, I am going to choose three names out of this wonderful band books mug, and then I will decide who I want to be, who I want to room with and or be friends with, and who I have to push off of a cliff. Um, I have put a whole bunch of names of female characters from books I've loved in this mug, and I will pick out three names. I have no idea how many rounds I put in here, so we'll see how long this takes. Round one. I picked up four things. That's wrong. I put one back. So I picked up Lola from Lola and the Boy Next Door. Then I picked up Blue from uh, The Raven Boys by Maggie Steve Fodder. And... Tris from the Divergent Trilogy. Great. This is already turning out to be so much fun. Um, I don't know what to do, guys. Okay, I think I'm going to be Blue from the Raven Boys. I'm going to be best friends in a room with Lola. And I'm going to push Triss off of a cliff. For reasons. Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna move on now. I really didn't want to do that, guys. I really didn't want to do that. Round two. So I have... Margot Roth Spiegelman uh, from Paper Towns. I have Jenny from the It Girl series. She's also Jenny from the Gossip Girl series, but um, I really liked the It Girl series more than the Gossip Girl series. And don't mock me, because it was a series that I loved in high school, and it's actually really fun. So, yep. Yep. And third, we have Ginny! from the Harry Potter series. So I'm gonna be Ginny, guys. I'm gonna be Ginny. Ginny gets Harry. Yeah. And then I'm going to be, I'm gonna room with Jenny because I think she'd be an awesome roommate, actually. And I think Margot Roth Spiegelman would be a pretty terrible roommate. I don't wanna push her off of a cliff, but if it came down to who would be a better roommate, I think Jenny would be a better roommate. So I guess I'm cliffing Myrtle Roth Spiegelman. And now I'm gonna put these down and try to forget that any of this is happening. Round three. Next I have Phoebe from uh, the Beginning of Everything by Robin Schneider. Phoebe was actually like a sub-character, she wasn't even a main character, but I really liked her as a character, even though she didn't have a lot of like point plot points, I guess, but yeah, she was really good. And then Eleanor from Eleanor and Park, and Sam from Perks of Being a Wallflower. I think... I think I'm going to be, I think I'm going to be Sam from Bricks Being a Wallflower. Um, I mean she has a lot going on in her life that's kind of crummy, but I think she also has a lot going on in her life that's pretty awesome, and I think it would be really fun to have the friends that she has, and Pat, and Charlie, so yeah. 
And then I'm going to room with Eleanor from Eleanor and Park because she is an awesome human being. And I would like to be her friend. And unfortunately I am going to push Phoebe off of a cliff. And I really think that the only reason I'm doing that is because I didn't get to know her as a character any better. Like if she had been more of a main character I think I definitely would not have pushed her off of a cliff. Anyways, moving on. Round four. Next, I have Hazel from The Fault in Our Stars, Yvain from Stardust. I dropped it. And Anna from Anna and the French Kiss. Okay, so. I'm going to be Anna from Anna and the French Kiss because, um, yeah, she's pretty awesome. Also Paris, also Etienne, St. Clair, yeah. And then I'm going to room with Hazel because she's a wonderful human being who is intelligent and perceptive and wonderful and I want to be her friend. And unfortunately I'm going to push Yvain off of a cliff. Yeah. Round five. Cather from Fangirl, Vera from Please Ignore Vera Dietz, and Auden from Along for the Ride. No. Okay, so I'm going to be Cather. I don't even need to think about that. She's wonderful. She writes fan fiction and Levi. So, yeah, I'm being Cather. And I'm going to room with Auden because she's intelligent and I think she's also meticulous and I think that she would be a wonderful roommate. And I'm going to push Vera off of a cliff. She's had a really rough life, that girl. Round six. I have Hit Girl from the Kick-Ass series, I have Brett from the It Girl series, and I have Luna from the Harry Potter series. Okay. Uh, this one's actually really hard. See guys, I don't want to be Luna because I think I want to be best friends with Luna. I think it would be much more fun to be best friends with her than to be her. So I'm gonna room with Luna, no matter what. And I think I'm gonna be Brett. I think I, I always really resonated with her while I was reading that series, so yeah. I think I'm gonna be Brett, and unfortunately I'm going to push Hit Girl off of a cliff. Unfortunately. Round seven. I have... Holding this cup is like getting really difficult, guys. Lindsay from An Abundance of Catherines. Oh, I picked up two at once. Perfect. Sam from Before I Fall. And Katniss from The Hunger Games. Okay. So I am going to be Lindsay from Abundance of Catherines because, yeah, she's fun and she has a really good head on her shoulders and I don't want to be Katniss because I don't want to put up with what she has to put up with. However, I am going to room with Katniss because she's badass and if there happens to be an apocalypse or some kind of world craziness or a war or anything, she could probably save my life because I certainly probably couldn't save my own life. So, yep, yep. And unfortunately, I'm going to push Sam from before I fall off of a cliff. Round eight. First, oh, first I have, if I could open this, 
First I have Hadley from The Statistical Probability of Love at First Sight. And then I have Jubilee from the Jubilee Express, which is a short story in Let It Snow. It's by Maureen Johnson, the short story. And lastly I have Ramona Flowers from the Scott Pilgrim series. I am going to be Jubilee because yeah, if you haven't read that book or that short story, you have to. It's beautiful and wonderful and I love it. So I'm going to be Jubilee. And I'm going to be... I'm going to room with Hadley because she'd be a better roommate. I think Ramona Flowers would flake all the time and never pay rent. She'd be wonderful to be around and she'd be very fun, but she wouldn't be a very wonderful roommate, I don't think. So I'm going to push her off a cliff because that's the only other option I have. Round nine! Look at how perfectly that worked out. There's only three left. Wonderful. So, for this last round I have Hermione from the Harry Potter series. I'm not even sure I care who's the rest of them. I'm going to be Hermione. I'm going to be Hermione. So, pretty much these two, one of them's going to die. Then I have... Julie from Warm Bodies and Astrid from Ask the Passengers. This is unfortunate. Um, I'm in a room with Astrid from Ask the Passengers because she's adorable and her view of life is just brilliant and wonderful and I would just love to talk to her about her view of life and just befriend her because I think that'd be amazing and being Hermione would also be amazing because um, Hermione and Intelligence and Ron Weasley. So, yeah. Yeah. I'm really excited about being Hermione. It's like a life goal for me. And unfortunately, I'm going to have to push Julie off of a cliff. Maybe R will save her. Because he can't really die. You never know. So yeah, that was my B room cliff tag. This was actually ridiculously difficult, so I commend everyone who's done this tag because it's really hard to push some of your favorite characters off of a cliff. So yeah, um, I'm probably going to do a Merry Kiss cliff tag now because I feel like I should do both of them if I'm gonna do one. Um, so hopefully that's not as hard as this. I actually think this is probably gonna be harder just for the sole reason that uh, I think it's harder to push your friends off of a cliff than a boy. But you never know. You never know. So yeah, feel free to comment below if you agree with my choices or disagree with them and explain why. I would love to hear your thoughts. And if you like the video, please hit that fun little thumbs up button down there and subscribe because I want to be your friend. And I hope that you want to be my friend. And I will see you guys soon with another video. Bye!